Airbus has publicly launched the new A220 narrowbody airliner following its acquisition and rebranding of Bombardier's C-Series program. The A220 expands the Airbus portfolio into the 100 to 150 seat segment of the market, giving it a way to attract new customers who may go on to buy aircraft from its larger product ranges. It allows us to now offer a very wide uh, uh, aircraft to the, to the market. So the family's extended really now from 100 seats up to like 240 seats. So, and uh, both products have uh, unbeatable economics and we have uh, the widest cabin in the segment. The move is especially significant given that Airbus's deadly rival Boeing seeks to expand its own product range through a proposed merger with Embraer's commercial aircraft division. This will mean the U.S. manufacturer can offer both the Embraer E2 series and its own 737 MAX family to compete with the A220-320 offering. We always wanted to be specifically competing in the 100 to 150 seat market, so it's really a perfect fit into the Airbus family. The fundamental difference is the C-Series was specifically designed for this segment, the engine was designed for this segment, and we provide the latest technology and a wider cabin, so it's unbeatable uh, offering to the market. Over and above the operational performance of the A220, Airbus believes that the cabin also gives it an edge. When we came to design the cross section, we put the passenger in the center of it. So you'll notice when you sit uh, different places, especially against the wall, the wall seems very vertical. It doesn't cross against your shoulder or your face. What we wanted to do is give back to the passengers the space they really want it, where they want it. Everything starts from that. So because the walls are nearly vertical, then that's why we can put large windows, which are actually larger than a 777. So there's one to two window per passenger. So a passenger ordering a seat, a window seat, will get a window. And further changes may be made to boost the commonality of the aircraft with its larger cousins in the Airbus family. Airbus launched uh, two years ago, if I believe, the Airspace brand. And uh, airspace is a de design language and a design signature. So the brand basically, in terms of design language, there are certain curvature that are more subtle, but that complements the whole design. So we'll look into what we can do to, to do that. However, the C-Series already share a lot of those elements with Airbus. And then there's the design signature. Those are elements that will identify the plane. So for instance, if all the um, Airbus product have the same latch, it's something subtle, but uh, it's something that's a signature. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it, and subscribe to our channel. Also, visit AINonline.com and check out our e-newsletters for all the latest on the aviation industry.